Meghan Markle faces losing battle over Prince Harry's bid to speak to William and Kate. It has emerged that Meghan, 42, the wife of Prince Harry, is preparing for a trip to the UK, and that she is fighting a lost struggle to prevent a family reunion. It's thought that the 39-year-old Duke of Sussex is organising a trip to the UK to commemorate the 10th anniversary of his passion project, the Invictus Games. Welcome to Royal Pancakes. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British monarchy. However, a source says Duchess Meghan is worried about Harry reaching out to her brother Prince William and sister-in-law Princess Kate, stating that she is in a losing battle. Meghan thinks he's making a big mistake, but she knows she is facing a losing battle when it comes to Harry trying to work things out with Kate and William, the source told OK. She clearly feels sorry for Kate and what she's going through, but in her mind, it doesn't change things, they continued. Harry reportedly wants to get back in touch with his estranged brother and sister-in-law after Princess Kate made her cancer diagnosis public. In addition, his father King Charles is receiving treatment for an unidentified type of cancer. According to royal analyst Richard Fitzwilliams, the brothers' individual health issues might be the game-changer for a potential reconciliation. He continued, with Catherine and the King's illness, that it is an enormous game-changer even when there are deep family rifts. Following his and wife Meghan's choice to openly discuss family matters in a candid Oprah Winfrey interview, as well as in the Duke's memoir Spare and in their Netflix documentary series, there was a rift between Prince Harry and prominent members of the royal family. Harry is mentioned as a guest for the special ceremony that is scheduled to take place at St. Paul's Cathedral, however, Meghan's participation is yet unknown. The new Netflix series starring Meghan Markle is scheduled to begin filming in a few hours, but it has been revealed that it won't be based in the Duke and Duchess of Sussex's Montecito mansion. On Tuesday, April 16, Meghan is set to begin recording her first solo series. However, fans may be disappointed to learn that the show will not allow viewers to see inside the house she shares with her spouse and their two children, Prince Archie, who is four years old, and Princess Lilibet, who is two years old. An adjacent property in the upscale California suburb, would serve as the filming location for the show, according to Richard Eden, royal editor of the Daily Mail. The editor was informed by a source that Netflix has rented a house in Montecito for filming. The show will correspond with Meghan's recently established lifestyle brand, American Riviera Orchard, which debuted on Instagram earlier this year and presently boasts over 590k followers. Celebrate the joys of cooking and gardening, entertainment, and friendship is the stated goal of the two new television programs that Meghan and Harry are producing for Netflix. According to the Daily Mail, the Intellectual Property Corporation, a division of Sony Pictures Television that also produces The D'Amelio Show on Hulu, is producing Meghan's show. The Duchess's name is on the guest list, and Meghan is expected to go to the UK with her husband. The mother of two, though, has TBC, to be confirmed, next to her name. The pair may send their two kids to London to celebrate the anniversary of the Games, but Meghan reportedly worries about their safety while they are there. The Prince has always enjoyed and played the professional sport of polo, which is the subject of Harry and Meghan's second Netflix original series. The Montecito-based pair will be executive producers of this series. The statement exclaims, the series will pull back the curtain on the grit and passion of the sport, capturing players and all it takes to compete at the highest level. It is known primarily for its aesthetic and social scene. Harry's closest buddy, Nacho Figueras, explained to Hello! Magazine how much playing polo means to Prince Harry. We have spent a great deal of time working on this. Harry's aim and desire has always been to teach the world what it takes to be a highly skilled polo player and to play show polo at the greatest level. 
I cannot imagine many people that can be better than him to be the beginning of this storytelling, he continued.